I still see your shadows in my room. Can't take back the love that I gave you. It's to the point where Yo, what is going on, everybody? It's Fresh One Series here, back with another video. Because you guys, an NBA 2K19 rebuilding video, and uh, today we're gonna be taking on the Brooklyn Nets, who are about to sign Kevin Durant, uh, Kyrie Irving, and the uh, Andre Jordan. So for team player options, we're just gonna hop right into this. I'll talk about my thoughts about it throughout the whole video, just you know, throughout that stuff. I, I did make the trade with Tarn Prince. I I didn't do that for some of my other rebuilds. I did. I did not even think about it. I also did get Jalen Hands on this team, the team's second round pick, because they did trade the 17th pick, I believe, which they had to the Hawks um, for Tarn Prince. So yeah, we're gonna be accepting these deals. Uh, only a couple mil here. I'm assuming I can still sign these other guys. Hopefully I can. They did offer it to D'Angelo, but they're going to have to renounce the rights, so I will not offer it. Not going to offer it to Ronnie Hollis Jefferson. Uh, Alan Williams, why not? Um, you know, if I don't, if I need to get rid of it, then I can do that. But obviously Kevin Durant uh, will throw a max deal at. Hopefully he'll sign with that. And then Kyrie Irving. Hopefully that's we have enough money to do that. And then we have to, I don't know how they're going to get DeAndre Jordan, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Uh, I'm not paying him that much money. Wherever he goes, I'm going to I'm gonna get him on the team somehow. Uh, I'm going to make sure I get these guys on there. Obviously, I think what I will do, I mean, this is a fantasy review, but I will, because Kevin Wright is going to be out for the next season, I will make him out for that season. Joe Harris might need to be, might, well, since Katie's not playing, I don't know. Uh, but actually, yeah, Joe Harris is probably going to get moved. That's my guess. I mean, when you look at the small forward position here, you're going to have Kevin Rain. You're going to have Tarn Prince, a solid player. And Young also got uh, Karukas, whatever his name is. And the Hornets are about to sign Terry Rozier to a three-year, $58 million signed trade deal. Uh, but Joe Harris, we're going to look to move. Just on an expiring deal, so you should find something solid for him. Uh, Zaire Smith, Damian Jones. Did not do the Evan Turner trade uh, for Baysmark. Totally forgot about that. Uh, Rocco will be solid. Uh, I don't think we need that. We just need probably like, I mean, honestly, just kind of like a salary dump, but or a young player. Uh, first round pick, not too bad. Did not do the trade. Oh my gosh, I, I missed so many trades. Uh, two first there. Ooh, that first looks nice from the Hawks. I'm going to take these two first round. Ooh, never mind. It's not two first. Here we go. I'm going to take these from the Jazz. Send Joe Harris over there. Probably be a good fit for him. Uh, I'll also offer a deal to. Uh, we, we, of course, we have Bird Rights on Angel Russell. I guess I could offer him a deal and I could trade him to like the Lakers or something and then get like the Marcus Cousins. Or not the Marcus Cousins, DeAndre Jordan. I don't know why he wants so much. I'll just throw him the deal anyway. So we get Kyrie Irving and DeAndre Jordan, of course. We're not going to get Kevin Durant then. Um, but then I'll, I'll, find, I'll get Kevin Durant on the team. Don't worry about that. So I'll do both of those guys. Frank goes back to the Warriors. Obviously, not going to happen. All right, we're all set there. Let me go ahead. I'm not as I'm assuming that DeAndre Jordan's not gonna get that much, like 23 mil. He's not gonna get that much. They don't have that much room. I don't know how much he's gonna sign for. Considering what we did, just give her Joe Harris's contract. It's probably gonna be somewhere around like 10 mil. So I'm gonna do that. It's probably gonna be like 10 to 15. That's my guess. It could be less. We'll do about 10 mil, and then these other years we'll lower to about around 11 ish. I don't know. I mean, somehow they're signing him. Plus, they have Jared Allen, so... Yeah, it was a four-year deal to Kyrie Irving. They're going to be trading for Kevin Rand here. And we're going to force everything over. And now we got Kevin Rand on the team. And I'm going to make him injured for this next season. Just to make... I mean, this is a fantasy rebuild. We're just going to make it realistic in terms of that since he will not be playing this season. Okay, so now the team is set. We got Irving, Dinwiddie, Napier, and Jalen Hands. I don't know how that's going to work with... Uh, lots of solid point guards there. We got Karis Levert, Musa. We got Ta Katie injured with a win knocked on him, of course. Tara Prince will be the starting three for this coming season. And then uh, Karuk So, I'm just going to say that is his name. Um, he is going to be the backup there with his 75 overall. We're going to need to get a power forward here in free agency on a minimum deal. Obviously, I have no money. So, Trevor Booker uh, looks good to me. We'll throw him in off for then. I got to get probably like another one, just like a minimum deal. Like Be Michael Beasley. And then we'll be all set. We do get that. Uh, Trevor Booker, of course, Beasley does not want to sign. So let's go sign uh, Mike Scott. Hopefully he joins. He does. So now the team is looking nice. Not sure how this is going to work. Like To me, when you look at the contracts, I don't know how they are pulling this off. Uh, it'll probably come. I mean, like, but there's six mil. So somebody's probably, maybe DJ is getting a lot less or something. I don't know. Is there something? Oh, it's this guy. Whoever this is. Is this Darren Williams? 
six mil this must have got waived so that's how they have enough room they'll be just under so DJ will be getting like 10 mil okay so that makes sense um, and then they, I don't know if they're gonna sign Napier are they signing Napier? Okay, seems like Napier is going to be um, not given the, the offer or the qualifying offer or whatever it is I don't know um, so we're gonna be trying to trade him just away for something a couple first round picks you know which they'll do a nice job I don't know where he's gonna sign me saying Shabazz Napier to the Rockets I don't believe that uh, Nets can bring back Shabazz Napier, so uh, we just went ahead and traded away. I know, I, you know, I got a couple first, but hey, I made it work. So looking at the team now, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, or excuse me, five, six, seven, uh, eight, nine. We're gonna rock with that for this season, and so let's hop into player progression here. I don't think there's gonna be anything. KD is just gonna be down. Uh, but actually, Kyrie went kind of down. Let's hop into training camps. At training camps, we're only going to have one. I did not do anything to the staff because I have an uh, old save file. So I think what we're going to be doing is we're going to be sending Kyrie Irving there. He stays at A+. Here is the rotation for this first season. Kyrie getting 36, Karis LeVert 30, Tyron Prince 27, Trevor Booker 23, DeAndre Jordan 29, Dinwiddie 30, Jared Allen 27, uh, I'm just gonna say Krugos is 23, Musa 15. And for scoring options, of course, first is gonna be Kyrie Irving, and then I did send Jalen Hands down to the G League. Hopefully, he develops there, and now we could have a solid player. Another another one. Um, let's look at power rankings here for this first season. We are all the way at 24 by NBA.com. 2K Sports has us at 26. Mark Spears down to 25. Yeah, in the first season, we go 47-35, and 35, very solid record here. Giannis wins MVP, Ricky, you're going to say Zion, Lonzo Ball, 6th man of the year, defense player of the year, is Giannis, Marvin Bagley, most improved coach of the year, Brett Brown, the 60-22 and 22 record. Here are the All-NBA teams, Kyrie Irving on that on the All-NBA third team, and we're not going to get anybody else here, unfortunately, on the All-Rookie teams or anything like that, but uh, they're there for you guys to see. So let's look at the stats for this first season. Um, as we look at points per game, we were ninth, not too shabby. Points per or points allowed per game, we were eighth, and points differential we were sixth. Not bad at all. Uh, Kyrie Irving led the way with 27 points per game, six assists, five boards, shot 51% from the field while shooting 42% from downtown. Karis Lert with 15, Dinwiddie with 13, Tyron Prince with 12, Jared Allen with 10, Kruxos with uh, 10, DJ 9 and 13. Uh, Allen did have eight boards, also two blocks per game. DeAndre Jordan, uh, one block per game. Chad Burker, eight points. Musa, six. That's why Troy, why Troy Daniels played, but he got three points per game. And um, yeah, let's simulate the playoffs here. We are the fifth seed taking on the Cleveland Cavaliers. We'll take a look at their team after we beat them. We're down 1 0, 2 1 us, 2 2, 3 2 the Cavs, and we get eliminated in six, unfortunately. All right, well, kind of disappointing first year. I'm kind of surprised Kyrie Irving could lead us past this team, which doesn't look that good. Um, okay, well, <laughs> there goes that first season. But I'm going to talk about the Nets here. And, um, yeah, I'm trying to figure out how they're going to do this. Because they, they, they have to sign two max players in KD and um, Kyrie Irving. That's 60 mil right there. And then you're all, you, st you still have Dinwiddie's contract on the books as of right now. His and Joe Harris's. We made that trade and we're still kind of coming up a little bit short. I need to see, did the 76ers sign like Kawhi Leonard or something? Why is their team so good? Thompson and Middleton. Middleton did just re-up with um, the Bucks and Klay Thompson of course re-up with the Warriors in real life. But um, yeah, so I think that uh, the Nets are going to be you know very solid in a couple of years. Of course you got away for KD. Um, signing that of course big contract. So DeAndre Jordan is going to take a lot, like not that much money in order for this to work. I mean, just trying to sign, if we take a look at the salary cap table, just between KD and Irving, um, you know, that's 60, you know, upwards of 60 mil right there. Then you got Dinwiddie's contract, and just like that, you're already at um, 80 million, and then you got to fill the rest of the roster. So I'm not sure how that's going to work. Plus, we did have, um, you know, that one guy's contract, that's 5 mil or whatever, their Darren Williams contract. I think, I think that's what it was, not too sure. Um, but yeah, let's just hop into the league meetings, make sure everything is rejected. I don't really care about that stuff. I gotta turn the rules off. But let's hop into the draft lottery, see if we have anything uh, in this draft. Any picks? Uh, does not look like it. So I don't think we have anything to do. I'm gonna go to the draft, see if we have any picks. I didn't even see. We do have one. 
Okay, it's the 57th pick. I don't really care about that. Um, draw pick, best available, whatever. Not really worried about the draft. Just uh, only thing that matters now is Kevin Durant is going to be finally healthy. Um, for 69 overall, sign him in the G League. See what happens. Team player options. Definitely going to bring back Musa and Jared Allen. Both solid players. To Anthony Davis has declined. Qualifying offer. Now we got to pay Karis LeVert. I'm probably going to want like 20 mil or something. Anthony Davis. Can you imagine bringing him here? Uh, Karis LeVert wants 15 mil. I, I'm not. I'm all right with that. That works for me. Offer him a little less. He agrees. Tar oh, we got to bring back Tarn Prince too. Jeez. So we do get LeVert. I'm not sure why, but... Tyron Prince is a unrestricted free agent. Um, four years. I'm not sure why he's not. I don't have bird rights on him because he's been in the league for multiple years now. So I'm not sure why. Uh, I'm going to wait for him to sign somewhere and then I'll trade for him. Went to the Chicago Bulls. I got to override that one time real quick. And um, yeah, so now I mean I could I can just trade him away now because. Kruxos, I mean, I gotta pick one or the other here, or I can make him power forward and play him as a small ball four, something like that. I don't know what I want to do with that though. Hmm. Player progression: Kevin Durant almost uh, fully healthy here, but Jared down going up a little bit. Spencer Dinwiddie, all these guys. Nobody's regressing besides Booker. Prince, I moved him up to power four. He's gonna be our starting four for us. A little small ball action, and Jalen Hands up to a 73. Let's go to the training camps now. I must have skipped over staff signing. I'm stupid. Crap, I'm only going to have one freaking training camp. Oh my gosh. I'm so stupid. I didn't look at my coaches and stuff. Well, I'm going to be sending, um, I don't know, Jared Allen there, I guess. Look at this cheese. Jalen Brown is out here in free agency. I just went to free agency to sign one so I could send people to the G League, and he was out there. Uh, we're gonna get him for a one-year deal. I mean, do I do I dare keep him? I should probably just move him because I'm not gonna be able to pay him next year. I don't know why he, you know he didn't want that much and all that. So I'm gonna just trade him. I mean, I mean <laughs> I'll take it, bro. I will take it. Let's see if we can find anything for him. It's taking a little while. Maybe that means it's loading up some heat. This Magic team, they got Anthony Davis, Vucevic, and Mo Bamba, all at the center position. Holy cow! Uh, I'm going to get this guy. We're going to be doing this trade for Aaron Gordon, and they agreed to it straight up. So that turned out to be a big W for us. Now, let me look at the rotation here. We'll figure that out. Rotation for this second season. Kyrie Irving, 36. Karis LeVert, 29. KD, 36. Aaron Gordon, 30. Andre Jordan, 29. Jared Allen, 27. Dinwiddie, 23. Kruxos, 10. Booker, 10. Musa, 10. And then scoring options. Trent Peterson apparently is our coach. I gotta look at that. But Kyrie, I guess, is gonna be number one. Durant's gonna be number two. Let me look at the staff. I don't know what the heck happened, but Trent Peterson, I guess, is our coach there. We need definitely need a freaking new trainer, bro. Alright, well, these guys aren't much better. One year deal. For about that much. So I can get some new ones. Uh Trent Peterson, I don't really want you as my head coach. We're gonna fire our assistant coach. Hire, ooh, Pong is sold, but I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna get um, Owen Taylor here for about 900k. He accepts that. So now let's look at, oh, I didn't even do system proficiency last year. Balanced is the way to go here, it looks like. And that is what we're gonna be running then. Balanced system for Trent Peterson, and then let's look at power rankings. We are number seven. Number, oh my gosh, 2K Sports, 25 and seven for Mark Spears. We're re-signing. Uh, Crusoe's here to a two-year deal. Can't really re-sign anybody else. We're gonna have to be paying Aaron Go both Aaron Gordon and Jared Allen, uh, unfortunately. So yeah, we do a bird rights on though. So at the end of the second season, John Moran, most valuable player, Anthony Edwards, rookie of the year, sixth man of the year, Jared Culver, Anthony Davis, defense player of the year, and the Magic, Michael Porter Jr., most improved coach of the year is Trent Peterson with a 56 and 26 record, baby. Let's get it. Uh, here are the All NBA team. I didn't even hold on. Wait, 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 there we go. Did we get anybody on there like KD or um, Kyrie? We got Kyrie and KD on the All-NBA third team. Here's the All-Defensive teams. Did not get anybody on those. Here's the All-Rookie teams. I don't really care about those since we didn't have any, nobody on them. Uh, but yeah, let's hop into this. Uh, actually, first, 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 first. Let's look at the player stats for the season. Team stats first, actually. And we were fourth in scoring. Number one in defense, number one in points allowed. Looking at player stats, Kyrie, 24 in a game, 7 assists, 2 steals, shot 51% from the field, 41% from downtown, Kevin Durant, 23 
points per game, 5 boards, 5 assists, a steal, and 2 blocks per game, getting only 1 point, dang, 1.7 turnovers a game, 52% from deep, 41%. Uh, from the three-point line, freaking snake uh, for leaving OKC, and then he just left the Warriors. So it kind of sucks if you're a Warrior, because I mean, you don't, you obviously don't know what it feels like to be a Thunder fan if you're a Warrior fan, um, since you got Kevin Durant, you won some championships, but screw Kevin Durant for that. Um, anyway, Karis Levert, 13 points. Aaron Gordon, 13 points. Played solid for us at the four position. Did shoot the three a little bit as well, not too bad. Karis Levert played solid at the two position, and Spencer Dewey off the bench. Great six man for us, shooting 43% from downtown. Jared Allen, you guys Jordan, just getting some uh, easy buckets with DJ with three offensive rebounds per game, both grabbing a combined 20 boards a game, uh, getting blocks out there as well. Okay, Caruso and Musa, five points, Trevor Booker, four, and that rounds out this rotation. A really well built team, well oiled machine. This first round is going to be probably a sweep against the Wizards. It is. We're taking in the Orlando Magic. Um, uh oh, <laughs> taking on the Magic. Maybe we did trade uh, Jalen Brown to them earlier, of course. Let's not look at that. Let's look here. Um, KD closes out game, 30 points. Here's the Vert 24. Spencer Dinwiddie there. Kyrie, all these guys. Uh, let's just simulate the current round. See what happens. I'm expecting, you know, of course, another uh, win advance to the next round. 2-2. Two -two. Let's simulate the next game. We're up 3-2, winning six, got it, nice. Jalen Brown went to one, went off a little bit of 20 points right there. 80 19, no, so 3 13 downtown didn't exactly go off. But uh, AD Vucevic, solid games for us. Durant, Irving, uh, Gordon, Lavert, and DeAndre Jordan. Actually, a lot of just very solid performance there from the entire team. Let's uh, hop into the conference finals and take on the Toronto Raptors. And uh, we got the first game on them. This would be a great, entertaining series to watch. Let me see. Is it's Kawhi, Bazemore, Siakam, Podol. Solid team. Very solid team. 1-1. One, 2-1 one. One us. Let's, let's get this big break here. 3-1. 2-2. Okay. Okay. Let's win in game five. We did. Win in six. Win in six. All right. NBA Finals. Here we are. Would this happen in real life? Honestly, this is a legit question. You guys need to answer that on the comment section. In your number two, when Kyrie and KD are playing together and they build around them, they add a couple more veterans, some more pieces, maybe some young players, you know, who knows what happens. But will they make it? How far will they get in the 2020 2021 season? So obviously, you gotta wait for KD. Um, but you know, what would happen? We're down 1 0 here, and we're down. Freaking Rockets are a freaking cheese in this game, bro. 2 1, 3 1. Uh oh, gotta go to Simcast. Simcast is always my friend, and we are up here. Now we're losing. Now we're getting freaking blown. What the heck happened in the third quarter? All right, well, we just <laughs> blew that one out of the final season. Draft lottery. Do we got any picks? Doesn't look like it. We got 29 and 30. Nice. That's always nice. Staff signing. Chum Peterson, I mean, Brad, oh, I'm going to have to fire him because Brad Stevens is out here. Absolutely will sign Brad Stevens. That would be absolutely insane if we got them. Obviously, he does not, Brad Stevens and Kyrie do not mix, but this is a video game. Nobody cares about that. Um, we do get both those guys, and so now our team, oh, assistant coach. Can I get Trent Peterson as, like, the assistant coach? Let's go, baby. He just took a little lesser position. Works out perfectly for us. Let's go to the draft. Um, I might. I mean, I don't, I'm probably gonna run this team back. We'll see any reason why I shouldn't. This team is very solid. Young players are developing a little bit. I don't see any reason why I shouldn't run it back. So I'm just gonna. Oh, I just skipped the rookie signing. Oh well. Uh, we got Kyrie Walker, Alex Antetokounmpo. We had some second round picks too. I am going to. Uh, I'm gonna decline this. I will accept this guy since he's cheaper, and I guess I'll accept uh, on Tendi Kumbos because since he is a you know a relative of Giannis. Of course, Spencer Dimwi does decline, so we're gonna have to try to pay a few players here. Only personal offer to is Jared Allen. Make sure we get them back. So Bird writes Allen and Dinwiddie. Just pay them the gigantic dollars. Holy cow! We get both Trevor Booker. I need to bring back. For sure. I um, mean, if not him, some other solid power forward. Let's make sure we get these guys. We do. Power forward is now. You shouldn't want that much, I wouldn't think. We could bring in, like, Ryan Hollis Jefferson. Wants a little too much there. 
uh, Trevor Booker, he wants, oh yeah, he wants just a minimum deal. That works out perfectly. We get him, and we are all set for this next season. Player progression, Kyrie and Katie both 94 overall. Jared Allen, 87, developing really well. Uh, DeAndre Jordan, 85. Spencer Dinwiddie, 84. Gordon, 82. Dude does not develop in this game. Uh, Karisver, 81. Moose at 77. Hands, 75. Might look to get some minutes to him on this in this season. Let's go to training camps. At training camps, we're going to be sending Aaron Gordon. So the first one goes up to an A-. I will also send probably, should I look like Jalen Hands or Musa or something like this? I'll go Musa. Why not? B+. Plus. He goes up to, and then I'll also send Jared Allen. He stays at A, and that's that. Let's go to the next season. Here's the rotation for this third and final season. Kyrie Irving, 36. Karis Levert, 28. KD, 36. Aaron Gordon, 29. Jared Allen, 29. John Ray Jordan, 24. Uh, Spencer Dewey, 26. Caruso's 12. Musa and Booker, 10 each. Scoring options will be the same as last year. Uh, both, I mean, I'll just I'll just leave it as no preference. They'll figure it out themselves. System proficiency, balanced run. Yeah, I'll run balance. Game power rankings. We are ranked third uh, by NBA.com. 2K Sports. I don't know what they're smoking. There, we're at 22 there, and then third by Mark Spears. So I honestly have no idea what happened, but we went 43 and 39. <laughs> Zion Williamson was MVP, Evan Mobley, Rookie of the Year, Sixth Manager, Jarrett Culver again, Giannis, MVP, or er, Defensive Player of the Year, Tyler Hero, most improved. This is the rebuild on him um, earlier today. Hopefully this video will come out tonight, which will be Sunday, so we'll see what happens. Brett Brown, Coach of the Year, 65-17 and 17 record. I don't know why they're that good and we're that bad, but um, Kevin Durant on that team. No Kyrie Irving on any of these teams, unfortunately. Somehow Chris Paul makes it. Uh, Marvin Bagley makes that third team as well, defensive teams, our rookie teams. And let's go into our team stats and our player stats, see what was wrong. If, you know, see if we could tell, I don't know, uh, points allowed, we were bad. <laughs> we were um, 13th worst. Points per game, looks like we were not that, we were 7th, not too bad. Point differential, only 2.9, which was good enough for 8th uh, in the league. Player stats. Kyrie Irving, Durant did their thing, 24 each. Karis LeVert, didn't we? Did not really. I mean, yeah, I guess it was just Irving and Durant, and then Gordon only had 14 a game. Uh, look at their three point percentages there 43 and 45. And then Karis LeVert, only 12. A little less than last year, too. Didn't a little more than last year. Jared Allen, a little less. A little more on the boards, more on the blocks. DJ's going down, <laughs> less than rebounds, less than anything. I did change him to the starter though, halfway through the season we were doing bad. I don't know if it made us better or worse, I was doing some other stuff. Trevor Booker only four points, Moose only four, and uh, Crusoe's with only six. So um, yeah, probably I needed to make maybe a little bit more of an upgrade for this third and final season, but we're taking on the Bucks. we just hope we can win. I really do. We have Kevin Durant and Kyrie Irving, that, that should be enough to get us relatively far in the playoffs plus we have some other very solid depth on this team oh gosh sim cash game freaking seven better not blow this guys come on come on fourth quarter tie ball game oh yeah yeah i gotta do the play in the first round let's hope i don't choke but i am on superstar and these Kyrie in the, in the Nets uni looks kind of decent, not going to lie. Um, oh, open in the corner for three. Didn't we get a terrible release? Terrible release. Thank you, that's stupid. What? Oh, yeah. No, no. Oh, he missed. Give it to KD. I don't even like Kevin Durant, but you know what? He can shoot. So, oh, Kyrie Irving over for three deep. Come on, baby. Kyrie, big shot. Down by one. This new don't stand a chance against KD. All right, we are now up by one. Are you kidding me? Drop step, Durant. Just, he, mi he missed that? Are you kidding me, 2K? He missed that. Kevin Durant from two feet away. I know I hate Kevin Durant, but he, he really missed that. Oh, KD's open for three. He hits that. We are now tied at 112. Nope. Good block, Aaron Gordon. Give it to KD. That's Kyrie. Oh, wait, 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 give it to Kevin Durant. Kyrie, four, three. Gosh, overtime. All right, good job, 
boys. Nice. Alright, we're back in. Looks like uh, starters are in. I think DeAndre Jordan technically starts, but let's see if we can get Kyrie going. Come on, let's go. Gordon! No, no way. Good board. Oh, oh. Here's Levert. Back to Kyrie. Kevin Morant. Driving in. Oh my gosh, why are these guys missing these shots? Alright, Jared Allen, if you don't... No, 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 no. Please make it, please make it. Thank you. We're back up by four. KD. Oh no, that's my fault. My fault. My... Good board. Aaron Gordon to Karis Levert. Open for three. Ah, we're here. Come on, KD. Lock up. Get that out of here. Oh, Jared Allen had to foul. Flagrant? Really? Okay. Who the heck are you, Sharma? Come on. Let's go, Kyrie. And we get the two for one. Here we go. Going to Bledsoe. Over to Giannis. Versus Kevin Durant. Fading away. It's good. We're still up by one, though. So I'm going to give it to Kyrie. And hopefully he can make some free throws. Giannis, I'll give him the two. I will give him the two. All day. Give it to Kyrie. Give it to Kyrie. Here's the box score for the game. We did win. Of course, Giannis, 38 points, 22 rebounds. On the other side, KD, 39, 5, and 5. Uh, Kyrie 21 6 and 8. Spencer Dewey 14 and 2. Jerry Allen 14 and 12. And you guys can see some of the rest of the numbers on the screen. And um, yeah, so that's kind of sad that I had to use Simcast and play and hop in there and go to overtime to beat the Bucks in the first round. But it, you know what? Whatever. We're going to the next round. That's all that matters. Uh, we're taking on the number one seed, Philadelphia 76ers. Great. Um, why am I over there? Okay, let's simulate the current round get it to where it needs to be. Let's see the first game here. We're up 1-0 against this stack 76ers team. 1-1. 2-1 on us. Let's go. We're beating the best team in the league by record. 3-1. Come on, take it home in 5. Nice! We beat them. Joel Embiid. They have Oak Pala. Oak, Oak they have Ben Simmons, Clay Thompson. Pretty much the same team as they had last year. So that's a very solid team. Look at our numbers on that game. Uh, very solid performance from uh, some of our top players. And we are now in the conference finals taking on the Cleveland Cavaliers. I think, did we not lose to them like a couple years ago? I don't know. We're up 2-0, 3-0, easy dubs, 4-0 into the uh, NBA Finals. And we're taking on the Houston Rockets again. It's time for revenge. 1-1. 2-1. Oh, no. Oh, no. We had to make a 3-1 comeback to do this. We are not losing to the Rockets two years in a row. Come on, baby. Looks like we are in control of this game. And we will walk away with a W. Kyrie, 38-10. and 10, Near triple-double for him. And uh, they're pretty much the same team. I don't know why that team always does so good. Simcast here. See if we can force a game seven. In game number six. Nice first quarter. We are back in control. Oh, man. We are just dominating right now. Let's go, baby. We win by 14, Katie. And uh, Kyrie, 26-24. Levert, 18. Spencer Dewey, 17. Aaron Gordon, 15. Very solid performance from this team. Game 7 against the Rockets. This is what we want. A revenge chance after losing last year. I think we got swept. And we are dominating this game. And the Rockets are going to blow a 3-1 lead. I'm hopping to give you guys some more gameplay. We are now in the game. You guys can see I am on Superstar. And let's hop in here. That's our wide Dinwid. Did Kyrie like foul out or something? Then would he open for three? Bad, bad release. Thank you. Thank you, baby. Let's go, Aaron Gordon. Shooting the three. Feeling it. Up by 22 now. Karis Lavert, what a steal on James Harding. Go up with it. Throws it down. Big play from Karis Lavert. Let's go, Kyrie. Break some ankles, baby. Oh, I'm jacking that. Kyrie is nasty. Durant wide open from the mid range. Green. Hey, that works. Durant from deep. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, Kevin Durant. <laughs> yeah, I'm on Super. I hate Kevin Durant. It's, just, it's annoying to see that. Like, it's pretty crazy, but I still hate Kevin Durant. Kyrie Harry hit that too. Oh my goodness. Jeez, I gotta send cast out here so I don't see the whole celebration thing. 139 to 116, your final score. James Harden, Damari Carroll, and uh, Chris Paul. Also, Capella on the way for the Rockets. Durant, Aaron Gordon, Spencer Dinwiddie, Kyrie. Great games. De uh, DeAndre Jordan, Jared Allen, Karis Avert. Great games from them. Musa, Kurt Crusoe, and Booker. We really just kind of kept the same team, honestly. Just waited for Durant to come back. It kind of built around that, added in Aaron Gordon, added, you know, um, I think that's actually it. We, our big acquisition was just Aaron Gordon, and that was it. I don't think we really drafted anybody, so Kyrie Irving's actually finals MVP, 26 points per game, about almost 10 assists, and I shoot 55% from the field, 53% overall from, or 53% from deep. Oh my gosh, bro, I always mess that up, but in seven games, we win that. That was a good playoff stats, and it's a great way to, great way to close it out after having a really bad regular KD. And Kyrie with about 48 points combined from them, seven assists, four uh, about a block from KD, while shooting very uh, efficiently from uh, both the field and downtown. Aaron Gordon, 14 points per game, Carlos Levert 12, uh, Dinwiddie 11, Jared Allen 9, DJ 7, and then Kruxos, Musa, and Booker all around four to six range. And you guys can see some of these other. Uh, three point percentage stats is, and all that other good stuff. You want to see that? Pause it, whatever. Let's look at team stats and then I'll close it out. So we were number three in scoring, number nine actually in defense, and uh, number two in point differential. If you guys did enjoy this video, if you did, make sure to go ahead and drop a like the video, subscribe for more content, and let me know what rebuilds you want to see now that free agency is kind of underway and uh, what's happening, you know, all that good stuff. So let me know, comment down below what you want to see next and I'll try to do my best to do it. I'm not going to be doing all of them, I'm only going to be doing a couple more fantasy rebuilds and then I'm going to be launching into my uh, 30 team realistic rebuild, 2020 realistic rebuild for every single team. I'm going to be doing that uh, throughout July and August till I finish that and I'm going to be doing that along with my career episodes uh, until 2K20 comes out and um, yeah, so go ahead and jump like the video, subscribe for more content I'll see you all in the next one. Peace. Thank you.